but we're here at the American Girl Doll store at the Florida Mall, and Pam is coming along in our bag, and let's go take a look around. Or, I think they're like us. And back to you. Here's Luciana's Mars Habitat simulation thing. So it slides open. And the stickers that are on the wall, at least, I think the sticker is on the wall over here. Like it comes in like a packet and you can like put the stickers on here that says food. And there's some other storage, other storage containers and you can put whatever you want on it. Oh, there's workout things in there. And there, it's like three doors so it's easy to play with the different rooms. Here's like gardening and science glove boxes. So you can open it, put in what you want. And then your dolls can put it in there. And then the final room is like the controls. And oh, it's, oh, it's a 3D printer. I remember. And oh, you can turn the handle, and it's like it prints it. new shaved ice stand right here so it's like you have the fruit flavors for the shaved ice and I think this oh yeah it's removable and it looks like this can be held by the doll oh and it can be removed so I guess you can be like pop here's your shaved ice and then they can hand it to the doll and they can hold it oh it looks like there's some holders over here like to put the shaved ice in What's this behind the fruit? Oh, it's like you scoop the ice out here and then it goes like boop, boop. Wow, this is real metal. Is this like real metal? And Kanani is Naya's dog. Mealy, am, am I pronouncing that right? And, oh look, he, it's like he sleeps in pineapple. I'd like to sleep in pineapple, though it would probably be very pokey. Just noticed is, yay, there's a new dog, but that's a place where a coconut used to reside. I think they, did they take out coconut? If you've seen him in the stores recently, comment down below, because I, I realized I haven't seen him for a while, unless you count those large plushes over there, but I mean for the dogs, not plushes for the girls in the car now and when we left the store we forgot to do the review so of like the store so we're gonna do it now the store was really nice the the people were really nice since I have my allergies the the like the chef at the bistro came out and was like telling us what we could have even though we had already had lunch we could like when we come back another time maybe we could have lunch there apparently they have gluten-free buns and i thought the store was really nice but being a dc girl that store was really small compared to the one we used to go to and we'll do an unboxing later